Hey guys, uh, we found these uh, two computers uh, last year, May, May and June. So, um, this Sony Vio here, I actually put it in the freezer for uh, a few days. Uh, it does work, but it's kind of limited. It has um, a Pentium 4, uh, 2.8 gigahertz, and it's running uh, updated Service Pack 3 uh, X Windows XP. So that that's good, but I noticed the the DVD uh, thing is not working. Uh, it's not reading or something, uh, but it is working kind of like uh, everything else works on this computer. Uh, so that's good for uh, games or something. Um, the battery seems to kind of work, uh, but this one here, this is uh, is one is pretty good. It's um, it's an i3. It says Core i3. If you can see that, so um, it says Senti or something like that. Never heard of that, uh, but uh, this one is good because it's an Asus. Uh, so um, you can see on the on the screen here, this is quite advanced uh, compared to uh, most of the computers I have. They don't have a BIOS like this. Uh, it's telling you right away your RPM. Uh, all kinds of stuff right here. So uh, this thing came with no hard drive. So I just put the one from the Dell and it boots into Windows right away. But uh, I was troubleshooting here for about 10-15 minutes. I couldn't get this thing to work. So what the issue was, first of all, I had no memory. So uh, I was trying different sticks. I'm not sure if this is DDR2 or 3 or whatever. It doesn't actually say. It just says kit one of three for six gigabytes. So I not sure it's from the the gateway computer so uh, I put it in this slot then I put in that nothing was working uh, but I noticed just like my other Asus the the older one is that you really gotta stick these uh, memory sticks properly in there it, it kind of like feels like it's in there the, the the white things clip on everything is in but it wasn't in far enough, I think, because uh, I pushed it, I took it out, stuck it in even harder, um, and, and all of a sudden, everything's working now. So, it's just the memory. Um, so, uh, yeah, we got no hard drive, but I put this one here from Adele. Everything's working. It just says it's not um, uh, activated or that you need to reactivate Windows 7. But uh, everything seems to be working. That, that fan on this power supply... Is blowing hard so that's even better than my gateway over here um, got all kinds of uh, I don't like how they keep uh, getting rid of the mouse like I had to put a USB mouse so uh, other than that this computer I took out the battery tr uh, while I was troubleshooting um, it only has two slots for memory um, I could put maybe a, a graphics card from the other Asus in here and see uh, how good this computer is because this is an i3 so that's pretty good not those dual core like those uh, most of those other computers I have so we got right here it says uh, i3-3220 and oh so this is a DDR3-2000 uh, that's like 2 gigabyte stick at 13-33 uh, megahertz so th this uh, this uh, this software is really good on here Okay guys, uh, thanks for watching. Have a nice day.